all of us, I believe. This is the first monthly Knox County School Bus Driver Safety Awards. That, I will briefly tell you how this came about. There's, of course, there's been a lot of uh, talk about our school buses in Knox County. And I knew for a fact there's a lot of them that do it right every single day. So I know a lot of the contractors, they're here. Dr. Grubb and I, who heads it up, we've been friends since probably seven years old. And I, I, I got together with, with all of these people, and uh, Dr. Grubb and I had lunch about two or three months ago, and I said, what can we do to make sure that people are doing it right know we appreciate it? And this is what Dr. Grubb and I talked about. And so I went back to WIBK where I work when I'm not doing all the other commission stuff. And I told uh, Corey Dixon, I need somebody to sponsor it. And she said, there's only one person I'm taking this to. And that was Andy White with Ted Russell Ford. And she went and spoke with him. He said, yes, we, we must do this. This is something that is community. This is good. And we would love to be part of that. So that's how it all came about. And uh, that's how we're here today. I'd like to kick things off. It won't be too long, but let's get started. Uh, uh, Dr. McIntyre is here, and he, he's going to say a few words. Dr. McIntyre. Thank you. Uh, good morning, and I will be very brief, or else uh, Dr. Grove and I are going to get our heads burned here, so uh, we'll, I'll, I'll be quick. I want to uh, thank you all for being here, and uh, it's a wonderful opportunity to recognize uh, some folks who are doing some terrific work for our children. And before we get too far along, I want to make sure I, I introduce our school board members who are here, uh, Terry Hill and Patty Bounds from the school board. Thanks for being with us today. I certainly want to thank uh, Ted Russell Ford for their sponsorship and their uh, engagement and support in our community. And I also want to thank uh, Mayor Bob, uh, nice. Commissioner Bob Thomas, uh, who, uh, <laughs> who, who uh, has been absolutely instrumental today in making sure that we are recognizing the great work that's happening. And, as Commissioner Thomas mentioned, uh, you know we we focused a lot on school bus safety uh, over the, over the years, and uh, we've been able to put in place a, a number of different really important strategies to ensure that our kids are getting to and from school safely and on time. And uh, things like we put in place a safety check ride system where uh, one, our uniformed officers will board a bus and they'll uh, do a, vi a, a visual inspection of the equipment and also observe the operation of the vehicle. And what we have found is that, you know, there's some suggestions to be made along the way, but really the vast majority of the school bus drivers who are employed by the, our contractors who work for, for Knox County Schools are doing an incredible job. They care about the kids on their bus. They care about the families that they serve. They work hard every single day to make sure they get their kids to and from school safely and on time. And so today we're here to acknowledge that, to honor that, and to, to really uh, honor some of our school bus drivers who really represent the outstanding work that's happening uh, in our community, on our roads every morning and afternoon, and uh, the, the deep commitment that they have to our children in the Knox County School. So it's a great day, and it's a great way to really uh, highlight the positive aspects of the work that's going on in the Knox County Schools and in our community. And I want to thank, again, Commissioner Thomas for his leadership in making this happen today. Thank you so much. Also, she mentioned, I don't know if you've noticed, Wibbick the Frog is here. <laughs> I've known Wibbick the Frog since 1975. We go way back and the frog is not aged. I don't know how I have, the frog is not. Next, I want to introduce uh, really the gentleman that uh, this wouldn't have happened, these awards, if we had not, uh, he not stepped forward and said, yes, we must do it. It's the owner of Ted Russell Ford, Andy White. Thank you, Bob. Um, this isn't really about us or our store. It's about the folks standing behind me and it's about their commitment to the kids and uh, all, the, all the kids in Knox County. Um, we would like to leave it at that. We are very appreciative that WIVK, Bob and Corey came to us and asked us to do this because this is exactly what we like to do in our community. So without further ado, I would like to make sure that we recognize these folks that we're here to honor today. 
and it's a big privilege for them to be the first five. So uh, thank you guys for coming, and we're looking forward to a uh, long sponsorship with this program with WIVK. Thank you. All right, let's get started before we all burn up, right? All right, especially they're back here in front of all this glass. Uh, Dr. McIntyre is going to come forward, and Andy White as well, and uh, and present the. Uh, uh, we have a certificate of appreciation from Knox County Schools, and we have a hundred dollar check from Andy White and Ted Russell Ford. <coughs> the first name is Regina Patterson. Regina Patterson drives for Rudder Bus Line. She drives uh, the route at Pond Gap Elementary. She's been driving a bus for 12 years. Come on out in front of the podium here. Let's get a picture of you all on both sides of her. And she and Andy's got the $100 check. And let's give a big round of applause for Regina Patterson. Our second driver drives for Brenda Parton, drives a Spring Hill Elementary bus, uh, has been driving since 2014. His name is Ricky Denton. And Ricky, come on out. Out there in the middle. Come on, get your picture made. Get a hundred dollar check. You gotta smile, Rick. You gotta take a little appreciation. <laughs> Thank you, Ricky. Our next driver drives for Lynch bus lines, drives the Sunnyview Elementary, Chihuahua Elementary, Carter Middle, and Carter High School. And it's Esther McGinnis who has been driving a bus for 34 years. Years. Yeah. Yeah, front and center, Esther. There you go. Thank you to Esther for the great job she does. <laughs> Our next driver uh, drives for Rudder Bus Lines, uh, drives Cedar Buff Elementary and Hart Valley High School. He's been driving for 30 years because he also drove in Texas, also in Oak Ridge High School. And, uh, and in Knox County for the last year. His name is David Ray, and he's another one that's doing it right. You're there in the middle. We're going to get your picture. You're not going to hear a $100 check for you for David Ray. Thank you, David. Now, last but not least, which is what they always say, I don't know why, but Robert Bowling is who she, uh, she drives for. She drives Sequoia Elementary, West High School, has been driving for 14 years, and if you read the newspaper this past weekend, uh, there was a nice letter to the editor about her. This is Rhonda Gallia. <laughs> 14 years. Thank you, Rhonda Gallia. I want to thank everybody for being part of this. This is important. We're going to do this every month. We're shooting for the 18th of next month, so put it on your calendar. Um, but we've got to recognize and appreciate the people that are doing a good job, and there's a lot of them. I'll quickly say there's almost 385 bus drivers in ballpark. Every day in Knox County, the bus drivers drive 19,000 miles. Isn't that amazing? So thank you for being here, and thank you to all these drivers for doing it right.